Live from KTTC, your weather authority, this is KTTC News at 6. Thanks for joining us. Rochester students are back in school, and today Governor Tim Walz made a stop in the Med City to visit some of them. The state's top leader is celebrating a safe return to school, as well as continuing to encourage vaccination throughout the state. Our Carly Petrus joins us with what he said earlier today. Carly, what was the goal of today's visit? Well, Tom and Caitlin, joining the governor today at Jefferson Elementary was Education Commissioner Mueller and Interim Superintendent Piquel. They highlighted the importance of getting vaccinated to continue in-person learning. And this is our third school year of dealing with uh, COVID-19. As the academic year begins, the governor says he is visiting schools around the state for several reasons. One is because it's good for the soul, as you've seen. This is what this is what the hard work is about, keeping these little ones safe and keeping them in school, um, and also to highlight the work that's been done. That work includes using a portion of the federal relief fund to get kids caught up with learning this summer. We know that we have students who do need some additional help, that we have had disruption in our education. And so what we have been able to provide and to build is um, not only what we were able to do as a result of the ARP funds and the governor and lieutenant governor, what we were able to get through our legislature, and we're incredibly thankful for that work. COVID is much on everybody's minds. Masks are on people's minds. But I just want to say here in Rochester, we're committed to do all of those things. And we've had great support from the state, but we're also going to keep the main thing the main thing which is the education of our kids. According to Interim Superintendent Paquel, this means keeping Rochester Public Schools open and safe all year. One of his main goals is re-engaging students through relationships. First, we're gonna express care. We're gonna show them they matter. Second, we're gonna challenge growth. We're gonna say it's time to get back to learning. We need to push kids to re-engage. But then third, we're going to provide support. We're going to help these kids complete tasks and goals um, with the assistance they need. Fourth, we're going to share power. We're going to give kids voice and choice um, and take their ideas seriously, even in kindergarten. And then fifth, we're going to expand possibilities. We're going to introduce young people to new people, new places, new ways of being in the world. Governor Wall says the work is not done when it comes to the pandemic, but because of Rochester's high vaccination rate and the school board's ability to lead, he believes the opportunity for in-person learning will continue. Back to you. 